Good day, Sacramento. I'm Lori Wallace at Bishop's Pumpkin Farm. It's not pumpkin season, but springtime is an amazing time to be out here. And for the first time in two years, they are having in-person field trips. So they had their first one yesterday. The next group is coming on over here to the garden at about 9.15, which is right now. So they'll be showing up any minute. The team leaders are all ready. And as I showed you last hour, the bakery is open for this little window of time. Um, so the adults are loving that. They can come out here grab a burger, they can go to the bakery, but everything else is pretty much closed and it's just for the kids right now. So, and let's talk about this. You guys were so excited to finally have these kids back here out at the farm. Yeah, we have. We've missed two years and we've sorely missed the kids out here uh, educating them about California agriculture along with um, all the crops it takes to make a hamburger. Okay, so that was my next question. It's called the Hamburger Farm. Um, there's kind of a cute story behind it. Talk a little bit about what this day looks like for the kids. Um, they're going to come out and get on our train. They have a pit stop here at the hamburger farm. They get a tour from one of our great tour guides um, that take them to each crop. We have wheat that we make into flour. We have cucumbers that we make into pickles and so on. And um, they learn everything it takes. To, and then they get to go eat a hamburger for lunch. <laughs> they get to do everything from the beginning to the end out here. They even get to dig potatoes for french fries. Oh my goodness. So uh, what age groups do you have coming out here to the farm? We usually have preschool uh, to second or third grade. It is geared to second grade, um, so we love having those classes, but preschool is great too, and we just um, talk about colors, dig potatoes, do a lot of hands-on activities. We get to milk our pretend cow, so all the kids love to do that. And I was telling Ann, I don't know when the last time was that you guys were out here at Bishop's, but every time I come, there's something new that you see. And the kids not only get to do this, but when they first show up, they get a lot of playtime. You have a great playground here, and they get to experience more than just uh, the agriculture part. Right. I mean, we have our, our petting zoo, but they also get to go down our Coyote Mountain slides and, and mine for marbles, which does not have anything to do with agriculture. <laughs> but hey, it's fun and yeah. it keeps them busy. And it looks like they're arriving in style. The first group of the little field trip kids are showing up on the train, which they love. So, Ann, talk a little bit about the train ride and where they're going to go and what's the first thing on their agenda. They're going to stop here, and when they finish this loop, they will start stop right over here. And um, we have two groups on the train right now. We'll have two tour guides waiting to give them their to start their tour. So fun. Well, I can tell you that all of those kids were really hoping to be on TV because I watched them on the play structure before we started, and they were going absolutely crazy. They are so excited to be here. Uh, it's been a long time since most of these kids have been able to go out on a field trip. They're having a lot of fun, and I can't think of a better place to have your first field trip back than Bishop's Pumpkin Farm. That's where I'd want to come. I'll send it back to you guys in the studio. <laughs> Digging for potatoes for the french fries right up my alley. Thanks, How Lori. How cute is that? Right? So cute. Thanks, Lori. Well, keep